Hi, my name is Sebastian Matteau and today I would like to show you a remarkable plant, the Venus flytrap. Now the Venus flytrap is a carnivorous plant that preys on insects, mostly flies, and the way it captures flies is easily demonstrated by triggering the Venus flytrap with a paper clip, as you can see in this video. So the way it works is that you gradually slowly touch one of the hair sensors and then again, up, and then you see that the Venus flytrap responds by very quickly closing its leaves around the prey, right? So normally this, the, these hair sensors would have been triggered by a fly and the Venus flytrap would have captured the fly. And you see this is an extremely, by plant standards, an extremely rapid movement. Now what is remarkable about, uh, about this response of the Venus flytrap is that it is very similar to how human neurons work, even though, and I should be very clear about that, plants don't have neurons, right? But nevertheless, the principle is quite similar to how neurons in animals work. So when one of these hair sensors is, is triggered, the leaf of the plant is depolarized, so it has an electrical effect on the plant. When then a second hair sensor is triggered, so you always need to trigger two hand, hair sensors within a space of about 20 seconds. So, and then when the second hair sensor is triggered, the leaf is further depolarized. And when the depolarization exceeds a certain threshold, a motor response is triggered in the plant and the plant closes its leaves. Now, if you're familiar with uh, the basics of human neurophysiology, you will recognize that this is actually very similar to the action potential in human neurons. So the way that neurons communicate with each other also through depolarization and responses based on depolarization. So I really think that this is a very remarkable plant.